Hello, hello, viewers! Welcome again to Cat Eyes channel. Today, I will guide you to clear monastery mutated mode weekly area operation. Stay tuned, okay? In order to clear monastery mutated mode, you need minimum gathering level 48 to enter. The quest difficulty level will be based on your manor level. In this update, it is a monastery acid mutation mode. It will increase your chance to get acid cores. For monastery normal mode, you can check my old video. It is a bit different, but the main story is still the same. First, you can clear all infected along the way to help the caravan members. For a human, you can throw a green serum to help this deer to recover its HP. You can attack the pillar to kill this fat infected directly. Then run quickly. I am doing level 135 quest now. If you don't rush fast enough, you might get stressed. You need to help the wounded caravan member here. And clear all these infected around here fast. When the Iron Hand boss jumps down, it, ha it has a range of damage, don't get too close to him. After the first boss defeated, rush to the next gathering point to enter the castle. In Monastery Mutated Mode, you don't need to enter the Poisoned Cultivation Room anymore. You can go to the library directly by opening this gate. You can clear all infected here or leave them here just. You can simply run through them and clear each infected inside the library only. It's okay too. Then talk to Ingrid to get the clue of the books in the library. Collect three special books of hope in the bookshelves. After that, hand the books to Ingrid. Protect Ingrid while she is scanning the books. Defeat the second boss, Crystal Lizard Sequence Destroyer 102. This boss is similar to the Underwater Factory last boss. Hit the controller on his back to disable him. If he throws the blade at you, remember to stay away from his blade trajectory. Get ready to jump over his storm attack and get out of his crystal lizard attack or you will suffer his multiple damage. After done from here, all monsters out there are corrupted mode. Get ready to change your weapons with acid cores. In the monastery mutated mode, you can use this rope to cross over to the other side. Wait all the team members here in the set point and then move forward. You can get HP and shield recovery here from the deal that you have at the beginning. Go all the way forward and see the marks on the floor rushing forward to prove that you have stepped on the marks. If you run past the mark without stepping on it, you have to turn back, so don't suddenly go under before the quest touch changes. After going through the maze and pacifying Ingrid, we will face the corrupted Micropack Mutant. In the monastery mutated mode, you don't need to place foods here to weaken the boss. 
The macro pegmutant will mark a player and spawn pools of corruption at their feet, like this one in front of me. Pay attention to your position to avoid accumulating corrupt energy on your body. Keep a certain distance from it to avoid being sprayed with venom. It can cause huge damage if you are not careful survivors. That's it survivors. I hope you can clear this quest easily. Thank you for watching. See you guys. Bye.